New polls, like net positive or negative feelings towards some organizations and some politicians, mainly politicians. And I cropped it down so small that I don't remember where it's from, but it's still gonna be fun. So interestingly, for some reason, they threw the FBI on here and it's net positive is 34. So throughout all this, still very positive. But then they go to the politicians and some, you know, you won't be surprised to find out have big net positives. Joe Biden is at 32, more positive than negative. Barack Obama, 28 more positive than negative. They've got Oprah on here. She just now is on every poll, I guess. So she's at plus 24. And then you get down into the negatives. Oh, by the way, they didn't put Bernie on here. <laughs> what the hell are you doing, media? Uh, are there, I mean, granted, uh, Hillary Clinton's not on there either, so maybe they figured out ah, we won't put either. But they don't no, have Bernie. But, but Hillary Clinton's retired. I know. And Bernie's the yeah, most like popular the, politician in the country. You might want to put him in a poll of who's popular. Yeah, the only reason I mentioned her is because Mitt Romney is on here and he's at negative one. But he's about to run for Senate. That's probably, that's true. That's yeah. true. So then you get down to the negatives, and like Paul Ryan's a little bit negative, Mike Pence a little bit negative, Donald Trump's at negative 20, so pretty negative. And then poor uh, turtle Mitch McConnell at negative 26, so he's at 13% positive, but he is not the worst. At negative 26, he's not the worst. Can I guess you know, who is the lowest? I have no idea. I'm just guessing blind here. And he, he and his name hasn't been in the news in a while. I'm going to guess Ted Cruz. Uh, it is not. His name his name is not in the news. His name isn't in the polls either. <laughs> They're not even polling on Ted Cruz. Then most negative here is a non-politician, Steve Bannon. Oh. His positive rating, five. Wow. Five. His negative, and then you, so you might say, well, yeah, only like political junkies even know who he is. Of course, it's five. They're both gonna be low. No, his negative's 49. He's at negative 44, blowing every other politician, including Donald Trump, out of the water. Congratulations. He's got nobody left. I'd like to congratulate Dick Cheney for <laughs> former most unpopular person in politics ever. I think Cheney once dipped down to I don't remember if it was 13% or 9%. Something like that. Yeah, yeah but he like that's Bannon is at 5%. Five. Okay. He makes Chris Christie look like I don't know who's popular is it Bernie. He makes him look like Bernie. <laughs> so, um, wow. Yeah, that's what happens when uh, you lose your base and you never had the other side to begin with. So, Bannon, that is why he is out wandering in the middle of the ocean right now, yeah. uh, lost. Uh, or, uh, as I said originally, it, like the gravity analogy out in space, going what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I was on top of the world. <laughs> I didn't hear that before, Picture but I like Sandra that. Bullock <laughs> twirling around. <laughs> anyway, a anyway, first ever movie. Steve Bannon Sandra Bullock comparison, but not the last. <laughs> okay, five percent, Steve. Yeah. Hashtag eat it. Mr. Uncongeniality. If you like this video, bless your heart. We got a lot more where that came from. We do a full show every day, Monday through Friday. Come enjoy it ad free. By becoming a member, tytnetwork.com slash join.